All right, this car is for our, all the guys who's been following my naked styrene build. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to introduce the Black Widow. It's 1971 Plymouth Satellite GTX Pro Stock. Here for your viewing pleasure. What's up, universe? Model Mine 72 coming straight at you once again with a behind the styrene episode of one of my latest creations out of the Wicked Wizard Garage. This was an absolute joy to build. I love classic monogram kits. And this was no different. Um, decided to uh, go all out on this one. And even though I say she's like 99.9% .9 done, there's like a few more things that I'd like to add, like a like a, a parachute setup, maybe a maybe a wheelie bar, and um, there might be a couple other things here and there, but. For the most part, she's pretty much done. This was uh, my naked styrene build. So uh, came in the gloss black molded uh, plastic. And so there's no paint. Uh, it's just uh, buffed styrene, polished buff, polished styrene. This is a classic uh, monogram kit here from 1984. Just absolute honor to have such a kit. Uh, this is uh, the 1971 Plymouth Satellite, molded in black, 124 scale. What we actually did was uh, we turned it into a pro stock model. We got the uh, the whole theme for this one is. Uh, the, na the name of the car is uh, the Black Widow. Basically, you know, we got the black styrene. And then on the very front, I did hand paint the logo of the Black Widow Spider. Yeah, on the body here, I just happened to look in the parts box and find a GTX grill that fit this car perfectly so that that was just a, a, a lucky find I went with the red headlights and um, black washed the grill you can see the black widow marking on the hood of course I painted the marker lights Tail lights. <clears throat> One funny thing about this build was um, I was kind of in the middle of it when I saw a video of uh, one of my uh, subscribers, uh, Big Ken 62, out of the Rat Hole Garage. If you're not subscribed to him, shout out to Big Ken. Check him out. He wanted me to uh, build a 69 Camaro with a twin turbo setup. At the time, I was building this car, and uh, I said, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and throw twin turbo system setup on this beast. And uh, it blew my model mind. You know, 426 Hemi, uh, you say, uh, well, you know, that, that in itself is an engine to be reckoned with. But then... You know, you get a fully blown 426 monster, right? Okay, so that's awesome. Then you say, oh, well, let's throw some a twin turbo setup on it. Okay. And then you got two big boy bottles of NOS 
in the spray in, in the back. Uh, I think the Black Widow is a very appropriate name for this car, and uh, sh uh, she would definitely give give you the run for your money. And um, uh, she was absolute joy to put together, guys. Absolute joy. With the body off, you can see the fully detailed chassis we got here. I went with the aluminum background and then went with the, the red, gloss red roll bar and um, picked out a lot of details. The wheels, on uh, the rims came from a top fuel dragster kit and um, front wheels are the Burns front runners. The rear rears are the from the 1966 Nova Pro Street kit. Um, we got the 426 Hemi out of the 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 60. Eight Dodge Dart kit, and uh, we got a fully blown supercharger on top of that with um, the blower coming from the top fuel dragster kit, fully wired, plumbed, got yellow Excel spark plug wires with. Um, Guitar strings for uh, radiator hoses. Uh, we got guitar ball in pieces for the guitar pulleys, brass uh, pulleys. We got a uh, black electrical tape for the supercharger belt. And then um, if you look right here, you can see we got one, two, big turbo twin turbos set up for the intercooler all hooked up we got two big bottles of NOS sitting in the rear so she's on the juice so we got the fully blown 426 Hemi up in there with the twin turbo <clears throat> system set up with two big bottles of NOS so she is ready for business this was a really fun build Got the battery hooked up. Battery hooked up. Fuel cell. Fuel lines. NOS hooked up. <clears throat> yeah, this chassis came from. Um, Pro Stock Camaro. <clears throat> yeah, this um, chassis came from the Pro Stock Camaro chassis. There's some modifications. If, if, it fit absolutely uh, perfect for my my car. A uh, closer look at the interior tub here. We got the scratch built um, seat belts set up. 
Um, So your NOS system set up, ran, plumbed, battery, fuel cell. Put a really big oversized fuel cap on here so you can just pour your fuel, your rocket fuel <laughs> up in there. Four twenty six fully blown Hemi twin turbo two balls of NOS. Yeah, so this is my naked styrene build. Nineteen seventy one Plymouth satellite GTX Pro Stock. 426 fully blown Hemi, twin turbo setup, two bottles of NOS, I digress. This car was uh, absolute pure fantastic experience I love my old monogram classic kits There she is, guys. Big shout out to all my subscribers. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thanks for digging the channel. Thanks for letting me share my art with you guys. The Black Widow. What a concept. Yeah, this uh, piece was a, a definitely a concept from the beginning. Um, when I ran across this kit, I definitely knew that, you know, I wanted to put the, the Model My 72 burn on it. And um, I think she came out absolutely fantastic. I really do. Um, I think this this model, or if anybody runs across it and is uh, lucky enough to get a chance to build it, I highly recommend building this particular kit. Model Mine 72. Saying peace and love to all. Rock on, build strong. Till next time, guys. Keep laying the styrene.